This was day one of the tournament for the Potomac Bassmasters on Lake Gaston in October of 23. Um, if you've watched any of my videos down there in the past, you might recognize this point. It's pretty much where I always start. I love this area, uh, especially in overcast conditions. It's great whopper plopper territory. First spot of the day, just barely under 14 inches, but it's a start. There are a number of stumps in this area, and uh, the bass like to hold on them. It's again a great whopper plopper area. Throw, throw the, the plopper over the top of the sump, bring it right over the top, and a lot of times you'll get hit. Uh, in this particular case, I stopped paying attention for just a second and missed one. I uh, don't think it was that big, but uh, every opportunity missed is an opportunity lost. It's important to have a follow-up bait. I usually have a wacky Cinco. Occasionally I'll do something else, but the wacky Cinco is, is my kind of go-to follow-up bait. And a lot of times you can pick them up. Uh, in this particular case, I'm not sure if it was the fish or I just bumped up against the stump, but it kind of felt like there was something there for a second, but uh, wasn't able to, to bring it to fruition. Still fishing in the same general area, again around these docks there's a lot of stumps. A lot of times they're on the back side, uh, since I'm fishing by myself here I can uh, take the time to get an angle and come in backwards on the dock sometimes and uh, in this particular case I came in on the back side there was a nice little stump laying there and it uh, seemed like there was a, a fish hanging out on it so it was a good opportunity for me. Definitely use a few more of those.
we had overcast conditions all day, and as you can tell from the little blip on the camera there, it had just started to sprinkle on me a little bit, so I went and grabbed my raincoat here. Um, sometimes fishing in the rain can be your best opportunities. It wasn't the best day I've ever had out here, but uh, you'll see in a minute that it uh, did, did help me find a fish, it seems like, so not too, too mad about a little bit of sprinkles. Thirteen, that one's dangerous, but I can keep him at least for now. Feisty little guy, but absolutely no help. Unfortunately, that was the last one I caught on the day, so I only got four, didn't get a limit. I uh, don't remember exactly where I was, but I think I came in about third or fourth place uh, at the end of day one, and then uh, we'll move on to day two. But man, do they think they're better. <laughs> 